どんな優れた選手でも英雄であろうと天才であろうとあるいは死体であろうと一度に取れる行動は一つだけ右を向きながら左を向くことはできないしかしあなた様にはそれができるというわけですなまあそんな感じ目の戦士うじゃうじゃ殺すネズミネズミ is one of the warriors chosen for the zodiac war He wears a blue combat uniform and has a white facial mask with rodent-like ears to symbolize his zodiac. He also carries his sword. At first glance he was mysterious, not showing his powers or not even boasting. It appears that he doesn't even want to participate in the battle but in actuality, he already simulated the outcome. In all honesty, I thought that he was a crybaby and will just be killed in the early series, I waited. And waited for that part until the very end. Quite disappointing, honestly. He is serious, though a teenager, he acts more mature than the others. He feels sick whenever he thinks about how carefree and unaware the students at his school on the real conflicts in the world. He is rather pragmatic and realistic when he comes to certain situations like the Juni Tyson and is curious about Charya's mindset and views about pacifism. Now to his ability. The Hundred Paths of Nozumi-san. Yeah, you heard it right, Hundred Paths, which means he can carry out different choices at once, think of it as a multiverse thing. For example he is playing rock, paper and scissors, he can choose the three all at the same time, and take those paths one by one with their probable cause. If he chooses paper, then it will become his reality as if he never choose rock or scissor. Betsy. そんな変わったことはしてないよ<笑>抵抗しても無駄みたいだな確定 Most paths end up being largely similar and simultaneously experiencing 100 potential realities It comes with a heavy mental burden In other words, it's exhausting 簡単に言ってくれるぜ100の戦術を同時に遂行するのがどれだけ大変だと思ってるんだすげえ眠いっつーの。Number one. The only time he gets excited is when he's eating cheese. No two cheeses taste the same. Number two. He survived the Juni Tyson without having to actually fight. Thanks to his power makes him this. Number three. He once had a crush that he tried to confess to using his ability. The Hundred Paths of Nozumi San, but she rejected him in each possible reality. Number 4. Rad considers his power a burden, as a result of limitations and side effects. Experiencing 100 realities is physically and mentally exhausting, with the burden of recalling dozens of failures or gruesome deaths. In many cases, a positive or desired outcome simply isn't possible no matter what he tries. As such, He's forced to deal with 100 times the suffering as he fails each and every time. Number 5. His name, Nizumi. Means a rat that occupies the state of sleep. Ni. Means sleep. Sumi. Means to reside or dwell in. Nizumi. Means rat. Number 6. He really did not want to fight in the Zodiac War. And attempted to use his ability to find a reality where he was not chosen to do so. He was unsuccessful in that regard. Number 7. Probably the youngest of the warriors and still a high school student. In a deleted path, he tells Tiger that he is still a minor when she asks him to drink with her. Hey, you listening to me, Pipsqueak? Uh, yeah. Hey, then take a swig. Boom. Uh, no thanks, I'm underage. What did you say? Number 8. His killing style, killing all. He doesn't have to lift a finger for most of the Zodiac War, only killing one person by hand near the end. He just ends up killing all because he chose the reality that leads him to survival, and in this case, since he's in the Zodiac War, everyone else has to go. Number 9. Thinks the lowest of the competition, and believes the war only helps prolong everyone else's meaningless lives. After emerging the victor, however, Rad admits that a lot of this was actually posturing on his end. Right down to stating that he preferred that monkey would have won over him since she would have done the most good. <laughs>
シャリュウが人を最も救った戦士なら世界を最も殺した戦士は俺だな No.10 Bore and Chicken both mention having heard his voice somewhere but dismiss it あんたの優勝者にどこかで聞き覚えがみんなを生き返らせるって三段階いいえ少し気のせいです They have in an alternate reality Since Red can take 100 possible paths and choose the one he likes the most, reality corrects itself to the chosen path, leaving some residue in the form of hazy memories. I want to forget! I just want to forget I ever had this decision to make! <laughs> Very well. What a wonderful wish. One made sincerely from the bottom of your heart. 